hello everyone welcome back to a new video on dentistry and more today we have a demonstration of dental chair uh, it is uh, mainly for the dental students in the early years like uh, maybe first year and second year and uh, it might be helpful for the common people too so let me explain uh, part by part of a dental chair so this is where the patient is seated so this is the patient's seat and this one is patient's backrest headrest these are the handles so this headrest uh, can be changed its position according to the dentist convenience you can change it like this by rotating this no so this is headrest backrest and seat so this can be moved based on the dentist uh, treatment procedure accessibility and convenience so first uh, let's start with the power unit so it's on already so we have control panel at various positions one control panel is here so you can see the dental chair is moving so it's already at the highest position so we keep it down so it is going down so we have this particular symbol so this will go down okay and this one is for the backrest can be put in various position by applying this so sometimes uh, the dentist may need a more supine position or more position uh, lying position for treating uh, the upper teeth and even for lower teeth he wanted a upright position so the same thing can be applied from here also here also we have control panel so when a uh, patient needs to do immediately while doing the procedure uh, this panel may not be very accessible at the point of time so we can uh, press this button so do the positional change so okay so this part is known as spittoon where the patient is spits during the procedures <laughs> so the saliva and all this collected here and it will drain off so we have uh, drains connected bottom of the chair so we have two symbols here you can see these two one is uh, you can see a bottle a glass picture and this is spittoon so if you press this one there is water coming out so it can be used for the patient for gargling and for washing the mouth this is for cleaning this um, spittoon so these two are the suctions so we have two types of suction so this is to uh, do the suction of uh, saliva and blood while doing the procedure a suction tip will be connected here and do the suction so this is we already shown the x-ray unit so this is <coughs> this one has two outlet one is for water and one is for air uh, the compressor is not on so this is for air you can see it this is for air and this is for water while doing the procedure we need to uh, clear the cavity or the clear the tooth of debris so we need to wash the debris so we can uh, apply water from this outlet and uh, we have various uh, connecting cords here this one is for uh, cleaning uh, scale is we call it is for cleaning purpose and this is we connect aerotor so it is to cut tooth 
and um, prepare the cavity this is for micro motor it is a slow running uh, tooth cutting device this is the same thing uh, we have water and air options here this is a dental stool where the dentist is seated so it has uh, tires at the base so it can be easily moved by the dentist while seated this is a light device we can uh, change the position by rotating it and uh, this is uh, easily rotatable and before uh, some years uh, the light was used to operate it by using switch but nowadays due to the infection control so now it has hand signal so we can change it by using hands without touching the instrument so this is handle this is uh, instrument keeping tray so we can keep our instruments here and this device is to visualize the x-ray if we have a x-ray film we can visualize here there is a switch over here this is for visualizing x-ray and we have this water bottle here so sterilized water will be used so after each patient or once the water is finished we can uh, refill it with sterilized or filtered water control if we are if our both hands are busy with patient and if suction tip we can change the position by keeping this it's the same function as this control panel only thing uh, we can operate it with operate it with our foot foot control so this yellow and this blue are for aerotor and scaler so scaler is nothing but a cleaning device so it can be pressed here and do the procedure so aerotor is blue one so we'll connect the aerotor into to the cord and so i have connected all the basic instruments this is scaler this we use for cleaning the teeth so you can see a tip over here so this is the part which cleans the teeth it removes calculus and debris this is known as aerotor so it runs at very high speed 2 to 3 lakh rpm so it cuts the teeth and it is used for cavity preparation uh, and uh, tooth preparation for fabrication of new teeth it is artificial teeth so this is uh, similar to the aerotor but it runs very slow for uh, this is known as micro motor it cuts the tooth at very slow speed so these are the basic parts of a dental chair uh the basic parts are seat headrest uh backrest the suction unit spittoon the water unit uh the light unit and the basic parts the air and water air and water unit and this tray keeping part and the light device for x-ray viewing so that's all about the dental chair it is very basic thing and it is uh, well known for all the dentist so this video is mainly for the beginners and for the common people so i'll come up with a new session in dentistry and more thank you for watching